Is it cake? Today we hired April from Netflix's Is It Cake to make five different hyper-realistic cakes hidden amongst real objects. And Kev and I are gonna be competing against each other to guess which of the items is the imposter. We're gonna be standing far away from the cakes and have 10 seconds to guess. And to make it harder, each round we're gonna throw in a new twist to just make it even more challenging. I want you all to play along at home, so comment your guesses down below as we go. April! Um, hyper realistic queen right here and she did all the cakes <laughs> and all the decors so I literally know nothing and I'm ready for round one. Me too. Yeah. All right, come on in. Okay. First category is fashion. You have 10 seconds starting now. Oh my oh, God. Oh no. Okay, hold on. Five seconds. Four, three, two. Oh, oh different. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> See? Okay. Kevin, why did you choose three? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you just panicked? Yeah, I was gonna go, I was gonna do one, okay. and then there was something about three. I feel it's like like the wrinkles or something in it, maybe. Okay. That yeah. gave you fondant vibes? Yeah, that's right. Give me fondant vibes. And Lori, why did you choose one? <laughs> well, <laughs> I don't know. I just I kept looking at it and I feel like I've done a lot of fondant bows. Okay. On cakes, I feel like that's a little bit of my upper hand. I feel like it's the straps, because like that looks like cork to me. Uh -huh. Well, let's see though, if you've got it right. Is it a bucket hat? Yay! Oh! <laughs> Is it cork wedge shoe? Yee. Yes! 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 I got a point! Oh. I got there a point! We go. And we have red velvet cake with cream cheese icing in there. That's crazy. I was a lot more That's confident. That's insane. Okay, so I thought from far away, it looked kind of like a fondant thing, but up close, honestly, it looks more realistic. <laughs> I think I was just like fondant folds. I could do that, so I guessed it, but like that actually you looks- You even did like the name. Yeah. yeah. That's, That's crazy. crazy. So the shoe was pretty much like a wedge shaped piece of cake, nothing sort of, no rocket science there. Um, I wanted to try to fool you by putting the cork, which is an edible image oh. all around the bottom, and then the sort of tied up kind of thing on the top I thought might mess you up. What is the flavor of this one? So this is red velvet with cream cheese frosting I'm gonna dig into. That's a good cake. Mm. I haven't had red velvet in like years. This makes me concerned as yeah. the rounds are gonna yeah. get harder. Was this supposed What's to be the one? easiest one? This was the easiest one. This was and the gimme. Right for round two? No. <laughs> <laughs> this round to make it harder, she's gonna be flashing lights in her eyes. This is the gardening theme. Are you ready? Ready. Okay, take down your boards. Start. Oh my God. Oh, that's so much worse. Come on. <laughs> oh, I'm Four, panicking. three. Oh my God. Two. Oh my God. One. Write something down. I have zero confidence in that. <laughs> How was the strobes in the eyes? Oh. That was challenging. That was a real challenge. Oh, different again, hey? Yeah. Why did you choose four? I have no idea. <laughs> because I was looking at the, like, the watering can, I was like, there's no way. Okay. There's no way. And then I was looking at the plant, I'm like, it's the pot for me? Because like I've seen like leaves done out of wafer and they look pretty realistic, but I feel like the pot looked really shiny. And then the other two, I... Okay. They just look like lawn ornaments. Okay. And why three? Um, I don't know anymore. Huh? <laughs> you okay. always choose okay. three. Number, I think that's just yeah, what you I do. Think it's just, I think it's just my number. Okay, one looks way too perfect. And okay. I think two has like enough details that I was like, there's no way. And I skipped past two and went to three and then I saw four. And four was like way too much detail. So that's why I picked three. But now I think it was I two. Think it two. I think it was two. I think it might be two. Yeah. Let's see if either of you got it right. No one was confident. No so one was confident. Start with it. <laughs> Four. Oh no, she's doing it first, it can't be cake. Okay, no, I'll start. Uh, <laughs> <gasps> oh, no. Yeah, that was that was an easy one. I saw that right away and knew that wasn't cake. No, I was like, oh, now it, you're it might be. I was like, it was the shape for me. Is it plants? No, no, it can't be plants. Not plants. I mean, it is plants. <laughs> Okay, so no winners in this round. Everyone said this was impossible. Let's see. Impossible. <laughs> All right. I feel kind of bad. Oh, yeah, that's, so a, that's a cute. detailed one. I love them. Oh my gosh. Also, awesome. not any of them be cake. <laughs> Sorry, sir. Oh my Sorry, God. Sorry, sir. Oh, man. There we go. How? All right. 
no way. Ta da. There's no way. Blue interior Ugh. to match his blue Wrong coat. Again. Oh my you got god. It. Legitimately, like yeah. even close up. You know what I thought would throw you? This is what we called on the show Tiltscape. <laughs> oh yeah. If your tiltscape's off, if there's not enough of an air gap, then you have a horrible tiltscape. Interesting. It's not a word. It doesn't exist. We made it up. There's like a hole, you know, it's kind yeah. of like creating this illusion. <laughs> there's a hole through yeah. that. <laughs> this is vanilla with what? Uh, white chocolate ganache. Good crumb? Good crumb? I don't even know what that means. <laughs> <laughs> There's crumbs. Oh, good crumb. And they're good. How did you make this? So it's really started with the structure. I really wanted to sort of fool you. Um, so underneath this, there's a cup, there's three dowels, sort of like as a triangle supporting the cake board. And then I just kind of carved a triangle of cake, put modeling chocolate on top, and just hand formed the face and the. You hand formed the face? I mean, I could do that. <laughs> <laughs> this makes me so nervous for the next ones. Just kidding, these aren't cakes, but they are amazing. This is what I got this month from Carev, and I wanna thank them so much for sponsoring this video. I find it impossible to keep on top of my vitamins unless I am super organized. I love that they're an online subscription service, so I don't need to remember to refill my vitamins every month, but I really love that they're completely customizable to my specific needs. Everyone's health goals are completely different, and it's so hard knowing where to begin. So you can start by taking their quiz. They'll ask you things like how you're feeling and what you want to improve, including stress and sleep and energy. Then they'll make suggestions based on your answers and you'll get your personalized daily packs and products shipped right to your door. If I know myself well, I know that I like to hibernate through the fall and winter, so a little bit extra vitamin D is a must for me. After a few months of taking vitamins though, my doctor tells me that I now have better blood work than hers. And I've been feeling so amazing compared to where I started a few years ago. Click the link down below to take Caro's quiz and find out what's recommended for you. And you guys can use my code ICINGARTIST for 50% off your first order. Next round. This next challenge, they're gonna be throwing Archie's dog toys at us. If you like this kind of video, please make sure to hit the like button because it really helps us out a lot. Are you close to this whole time? <laughs> I don't know if it's in the same spot. I knew she was cheating somehow. Like NPC <laughs> <right> now. <laughs> okay, so this round is all baking ingredients, ingredients that I'm sure Lori and I are both very familiar with. Okay, all right. <laughs> all right, are you ready? Yeah. Ready. Go. Oh my god! 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 Oh, time's up, time's up! Okay, we guess the same thing. Nice I one. I think I hit them oh. once. All right, all right, all right. What do we have? We guessed the same one oh, this time. Oh, we were on the same page this time. The same one, except like, I kept looking back and forth because I really thought it was two. Okay. Yeah, that's, it looks about weird. The, the label that I was like, that looks like it could be an edible image. Yeah. But then I kept looking at four, but all of them, while things were being thrown at <laughs> you, that was impossible. So I don't know. I don't know that I feel too confident. Okay. Kevin? Yeah, I'm thinking the same thing. Two looks like it's not like a normal brand or something. Like, did you put a different label on it? Maybe. I and then like... the, the sugar and the baking soda, the those, look, those look normal. The eggs know. look like a little, the shape is a little the bit like skinny like or narrow. Suspicious. You said it could not be baking soda? I don't think, I don't so. think so. You are right. Okay. This, this one, one, you did not recognize the label. Let's see. Okay, okay, it's good. Okay. okay. <laughs> you are absolutely right. It is the eggs. It's the eggs. It's the I eggs. Got points. Oh my God. Okay, so we're gonna cut we right board. through the carton and through the eggs. Ta da. Oh my God. So these are fudge cake pops. And I tell you, it's hard to make eggs. So the eggs are cake pop, of course. It's, you don't wanna have enough room for a layered cake in there. It's just fudge. I had a sort of egg-shaped mold and very carefully used modeling chocolate to try to make a seamless shell. And then with the carton, I had a plastic carton, obviously cleaned it up very well and used that as a mold. And um, I added some texturing to make it look like that sort of recycled cardboard with um, paper towels. That's clever, wow. very That's clever. That's very clever, okay. Fudge. Mm. Good. Mm -hmm. It looks good. Like Easter. My favorite so far. Yay. Mm -hmm. Very fudgy. That's crazy. <laughs> the challenges are getting harder and the cakes are getting harder. Yeah. Yeah. I feel yeah. like that's 
not yeah. the way we should be doing it. No. <laughs> no. So this time we don't have to have our faces covered because they have the cakes covered. We're only gonna have three seconds to look at each one and try to figure out if we think it's cake or not without comparing it to anything. So it's heating up, <laughs> it's heating up in here. Ready? No, no not okay. ready? Okay, here we go. Number one. One, no. two, three. Oh, no, that's not Bye. enough time, that's not okay. enough time. <laughs> Number two. One, two, three. Number three. One, two, three. And number four. Ready? One, two, three. <gasps> oh, I have the least confidence of all the confidence I have. My confidence that is zero. I'm not 100%, but I'm like, I think I'm 75. You're 75? Yeah. Like the same one? Okay. So we have the classic the Big, Big Mac. Mac. And we have the Sort of sub. Sloppy sub. I couldn't even figure out what it was. The, cardboard, why I the it. cardboard looked too good on it. Two and three. So here oh, we go. Oh no! Chicken tenders <laughs> from Popeyes. <laughs> I didn't know she was making the cardboard. <laughs> oh. And it is a classic Canadian poutine. Yes, I tied it up. I was looking forward to snacking on that later. <laughs> that later. No. The cardboard seemed like a slightly off color to me. That's what. Yeah, that's when what you gave said it the away. cardboard, I was like, that that gave yeah, away. That's it was yeah, that's what gave it away. Wasn't even the fries. The, no, no, as soon as you said the, the, no, the fries up close, they look real. I mean, it's not French fry, but it's messing with me. Sorry, so how did you? So the fries are just individual sort of sticks of modeling chocolate. I chose Harvey's because they have the skin on, which I thought was fun. Oh, mm -hmm. And obviously poutine, because Canada. And then the gravy is just like a sugar glaze, and the cheese is also melted modeling chocolate. I actually torched that with a blowtorch. This oh, was the tricky, bag. the engineering the of the back. back. I had to put some bamboo skewers there to support oh. the back up. She has like the, the sauce mm -hmm. on the lid as if it would like yeah. open and it had right? sauce on yeah. it. I can appreciate the detail on this. I had to buy poutine to make poutine and it was a sacrifice, <laughs> but one I was willing to make. I'm gonna eat a fry. Okay, what was the flavor of this one? This one is French vanilla with white chocolate ganache. You can't go wrong. Mm -hmm. I love mm -hmm. modeling chocolate, actually. So this one, we're gonna be spinning around because apparently being really dizzy and not being able to see <laughs> is gonna be the most fun and challenging. <laughs> you ready to spin? Yeah, just don't knock me over. Okay, and it's a tie. We currently have two twos, so this is a tiebreaker. Tie it all comes down to this. Yeah. Okay, go for it. One, two, three, four, Five. I think I can do it on next show. Go, go, go. go. Got oh, 10 no. seconds, oh, 10 no. seconds, go. Oh I gave you actually a couple extra seconds. <laughs> Don't fall over. Don't fall over. Five seconds. No. Three, two, one. Write down your answers. How did we do? How did we do? Things just come in focus now. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure. <laughs> oh, look at you. So either we're going to be tied up, whether we got yeah. it right or wrong. Yeah, right. You guys got to let us know if you score better than us. Three's looking like a little wavy, maybe. Unless now that your eyes are in focus. Yeah. <laughs> I think Three's looking wavy because you're feeling <laughs> <laughs> This is absolutely a beer okay. scene. Okay. okay. You're seeing waviness? No. Okay. No wave. Okay. <laughs> and the one looks a little sus, too. Okay. Oh, category. What is the category? It's antiques, right? This is antiques. antiques. This is vintage, old stuff. Like, I did not expect when I turned around, I'm like, what are we looking at? <laughs> Just a random assortment of stuff. <laughs> oh okay. my god, okay. So okay. it was between these two. We're gonna do a tap tap. Mm. You chose two. Yeah, we chose two. Okay. This is killing me. No. This is it. I might need a blowtorch. That's cake? <laughs> She's still <laughs> trying to reckon. <laughs> I don't believe it! No, it's not! I don't believe you! Mwahaha. Is it actually one? It's chocolate. No. Yeah, I'm, I'm having a heart. There we go. Oh. Ah! There you go. I would have guessed every single oh one of gosh. those before wow. that one. Here wow. we go. I put, even put a value village tag. <laughs> Four ninety nine. That, that is detail. That, That's that is commitment. That's oh amazing. Oh my God. Okay, well, the score stands at 2-2. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah. 
No winners here. Oh, we're tied. Everyone's a winner or everyone's a loser. <laughs> <laughs> I want to know if anyone beat our score and guessed more than we did. And we're going to have to do another round of this. Like the video so we can do a second round and see who won. Yay. Do a tie right. This looked like plastic. That yeah. looks so realistic. The Value Village tag. Yeah, okay, so how'd you make this one? So this is all tempered white chocolate. Interestingly, I made it shiny to be like plastic and then made it all dusty and dirty. So there's a lot of different things there to try to trick you. I even like aged the little knob to adjust the <laughs> dial. But yeah, I found this actual skill at Value Village. It really was $4.99. Oh, wow. <laughs> did you, oh is this God. the actual scale or did you like just take an image? I took an image of the actual scale okay. um, cover and I kind of, you know, made it look patinaed, as they say. That's crazy. Got forks. Yeah. Okay. So here we have okay. red velvet again with white chocolate, which I just I love that combination. Oh, and this is all white chocolate on top. So really just a big giant chocolate bar. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not complaining because this is delicious. Well, you guys did pretty good. <laughs> pretty good. You did pretty good at fooling us. Oh my God. Yeah, that's very impressive. That's crazy. Well I saved the best for last. You yeah. really did. That one, that one got me. And the spinning. <laughs> Thank you so much for making all of these cakes and making such good decoys that fooled us <laughs> so hard. This is amazing. You guys want to check her out. She's going to have the full videos of like what she did and she has all the other stuff on her social media. April Julian Cakes, links down below. And don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss other videos like this. Bye guys. <laughs>